Female professors at UNM are taking a stand and speaking out after they say the university is paying them less than their male counterparts. Now they're suing. News 13's Francesca Washington has the story. For the past 20 years, Melissa Axelrod and Julie Shegney have called UNM home. This is a place that I'm really happy. I love UNM and I've I valued all my teaching and research that I've done here. But through the years, the English and linguistics professors say they learned they were being paid significantly less than their male counterparts. But as the years passed, um, the problem became larger. And by the time I finally became aware of it, um, the amount um, that I was earning was considerably less. Shagne says she brought her concerns to the head of the English department, but the university told her she didn't have a case. So I'll just let it go. You know, I'll have a good attitude and I'll do my job. But in June of last year, dozens of female staff members received a letter from the Equal Employment Opportunity Commission stating they were being paid less. The EEOC's investigation included 40 professors across four departments, economics, English, linguistics, and marketing. The EEOC made the determination nation essentially that uh, there's about a 2.8 million dollar uh, deficit owed to uh, their own professors who've been underpaid. My letter said the university owes you a hundred thousand dollars and you should get a lawyer. The letter prompted the two along with another professor to file suit against the university for violation of fair pay laws. But the women say it's about more than money. It's also about taking a stand. It's important for women to pay attention. Um, I think that too often we um, try to be good sports, which I think it's great. We should all be good sports, but um, we wind up being taken advantage of. Francesca Washington, KRQE News 13. We reached out to UNM for comment but did not hear back.